Hi, as we have already gone through with the introduction of HTML5, now in this video, we are going to see the basic syntax of HTML. So, if anyone who is not much familiar about the HTML implementation can go through this video and can see how to create the basic HTML5. So, let's start with the implementation for the basic syntax of HTML. Now, to get started with the implementation of HTML5, what I'll do, first of all, I will take an editor like Notepad++ right here for Windows operating system. So, this one will be used for writing all the HTML syntaxes. So, I'll start with the Angular tag like HTML and I will put a closing tag right after that. Closing tag would be having a slash just before the tag name, all right? So that means that we will start the document with the HTML tag and we will end it up with the HTML. In between, we will have a couple of main elements that is the head. And once we will close the head, we'll start the body. And whatever we want to display in the browser will be put inside the body section. In the head, generally we put the title which will be called the means which will be shown in the title bar of the browser. So here my sample page is the title and in the body I'll put anything which I want to show like h1 like it's the heading all right as you might know that we have the six sizes of heading out there. So this is the heading one all right in the head apart from the title you can put anything like script if you want to include any JavaScript, VB script or any particular kind of script out there, you can put it right there in the head section. You can include the CSS part out there and you can also reference to any predefined CSS or script file. So this one head section will be used for the title and for any resources which you want to use further in the page like script or style. In the body, you will be putting all the style elements including the table, heading, whatever text images you want to show in the browser main window. So once you are done with that, you will save this document. I will save that in the E drive HTML5 folder, HTML5 underscore demo folder like this one is the demo dot html all right since i'm working with notepad plus plus it gives me one more option of choosing the file type so here i have chosen html like hypertext markup language and after that i will click on the save once i have saved this window i will be able to find that in the particular location where i have saved it So I'll come to that particular location like a drive HTML5 and here I can find this demo.html. I'll open it. By default it is open in Chrome. So you can choose your browser of your choice. Here is the title which I have placed and right after that in the main section you can find the h1 tag which I have put heading 1 out there in the notepad plus plus all right so this is how you can start with the html implementation and in our coming videos we'll see the new elements or the new features provided by html5 tutorialspoint.com simply easy learning